Hello everyone, this is Mia Hussain. We are learning WordPress essential training on this section and in this video I will show you how to uh, make uh, make a legal protection on your WordPress uh, site content. Uh, that means uh, like this one, uh, you're you, in the site and you can show the page source uh, from here. And sometimes you use some uh, content, uh, premium content or product like this uh, on our product gallery here has the main product and this all products are just downloadable products uh, uh, action to uh, available and download after complete your payment to go the redirected download page and, and sometimes here as our another section uh, how you Ramadan uh, we have made it uh, for the Ramadan section and uh, also we uh, some something under, under construction for our site like uh, radio and uh, live television and uh, the next one is tutorials so uh, it's very important to make uh, legal protection on your site to uh, to remove the to uh, to make a uh, protection on your source code and something else like uh, uh, code source code and uh, uh, for that, uh, just to go on your uh, WordPress admin panel, I mean WordPress dashboard, uh, code, uh, site name slash WP admin. And from there, go on the plugin section. Uh, yes, uh, just showing you on uh, <coughs> make it as, uh, it's my dashboard. And uh, from here, I'm just going for the plugin uh, area. And look here, uh, install plugin, add new, and uh, something else here, website. So you have to uh, add a new plugin. I have already installed this plugin, but I'll show you how to add this. I'll just go the add new and uh, here the plugin install dot PSP. You can uh, add this plugin uh, by search and also can upload the plugin. I'll show the step by step. I already showed you how to uh, upload a plugin, but here I'm, I can show you. Let's so look here. Here's a uh, plugin uh, WP content copy protection. Uh, for the details, uh, click on the description. You'll get the link. I'll stay with. So, uh, if you used to upload this, just uh, simply download the plugin and in the zip file and select the zip folder to install. And if you want to add this plugin by default search, just select uh, or copy this and search for the plugin. Paste and search. <coughs> okay. Look here, uh, here is WP content protection is already installed on my uh, plugin area. Go, I'm gonna just going for the plugin area. Uh, look uh, here, my source code is uh, available right now. Uh, base source, okay. And uh, here is the WP content copy protection. Uh, okay, now I'll active the plugin. It's activating. Okay, it's complete. Uh, activate and now uh, I'll make reload on this page. Look uh, here. Uh, it's reloading on the page. Look now. Uh, you can't uh, copy any source code. I'm pressing my red button of my mouse, but it's not working and not showing any. Look here. Uh, you get an option to open link new tab, but you there's not uh, any uh, option to open source code uh, like this. I'm going for the shop section and just trying to open it and uh, just go for the news uh, here is the block uh, area Oops, and just open it and let me try to copy it and I marked it and now I can't copy it so uh, this is the process to uh, make your content protect from the copy and uh, also protect your source code uh, from the from your users uh, it was very simple process hope you understand this and if you don't understand please leave a comment on the comments area thank you see you again bye bye